Hello, Brian Lynch here. It's February 19th, 2012. I'm out at the house, and uh, we've had a couple uh, warm days. Uh, I think it got up into the 60s a couple uh, days ago. And uh, as you can see on this uh, nectarine tree, the, uh, the buds have uh, really started to get uh, pretty big. So it's a good time to start thinking about fungicides. Uh, most fungicides are preventative, uh, so they have to uh, be applied before uh, the fungus has a chance to get, take hold in order to be effective. One fungicide that I really like is uh, called Bordeaux Mixture. It's made from two different uh, chemicals. The first is hydrated lime. I can often find it in these big containers. And the second is copper sulfate, which has a, uh, a really nice blue color to it. Uh, the way I make uh, my solution is I take one pound of hydrated lime and I put it into one gallon of water, just fill up the container, and a pound of copper sulfate into a, uh, another gallon container, fill them both up with water. Uh, as you can see here, the uh, hydrated lime will eventually uh, settle out. You can see a little bit of a separation there. Uh, so it's all at the bottom, so you do have to give it a good shake. Uh, to get it back into solution. Now, once uh, you have these two uh, things, uh, just get a sprayer, kind of like this one, and I use two cups of hydrated, or two cups of copper sulfate, I should say, copper sulfate solution. use two cups of the hydrated lime solution, pour it in. Uh, this is a gallon uh, sprayer, and I will uh, fill, fill it up with uh, one gallon of water. Uh, this will cause it to be a 10-10-100 uh, solution of uh, Bordeaux mixture. Uh, it's pretty good for a dormant spray, at least what I've found. And uh, like I said before, it's considered organic. Uh, one problem I've noticed with it is that it does leave a, a bit of a residue uh, in your sprayer, so be sure to uh, rinse out your sprayer after you're done, or, other, or otherwise you're going to end up with a, a very clogged sprayer. And uh, it's probably easiest just to replace it after it gets clogged. Uh, this particular one I think I got uh, for less than $5. So, I mean, it's no huge loss if the sprayer gets uh, destroyed, but, uh, you know, it's nice to be able to reuse them if you can. So, there you go. Nice uh, Bordeaux mixture. It's a, a good fungicide. Uh, uh, be sure to apply the fungicide uh, before, uh, you know, the fungal infection hits. Uh, most fungicides are preventative, so there you go. Nice uh, organic fungicide. Very easy to make.